dear customer welcome to tailorable tutorial now here we will see how to make sales entries with salesman record that can be utilized later for incentive calculation purpose or something like that okay so for that first of all we need to understand how to add a salesman into tailorable let us go to supplier master this is just this is a general account master actually click on add button enter the salesman name let's say salesman is dheeraj dheeraj kumar is my salesman kumar enter 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 now here you can see the group uh, which is selected is bank account here you have to select salesman enter 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 now here is a tick mark say he is salesman and click on save button directly so now you have added one account dheeraj kumar let us exit this form now uh, just to understand how many salesmen we have let us go back to supplier master on first tab there is an account list of account in this you have to select salesman group so that it will show you two accounts are there one is abid second is dheeraj kumar let us exit this form now we will go to sales entry this is sales entry click here okay press enter now as we have already selected default customer into the software okay as we have already selected default customer in our setting it will not ask you for any detail for customer directly barcode just on top of that you can see salesman abid and dheeraj kumar so here you have to select dheeraj kumar then we'll scan the barcode uh, for now we'll see this let's say 5 times 0 5 6 so this is barcode 5 times 0 5 6 enter this uh, sale is being made with salesman dheeraj kumar okay now here we'll see sgst cgst calculated uh, on terms of including taxes 2.5 sgst 2.5 igst cgst and accordingly the total calculations has been made if you want to give any discount you click here say five percent enter so all of the calculations have been changed and now you can see the taxable amount is 722 only okay click on save your bill is saved we want to press invoice print invoice i'll click on no you may you are open to click on yes or no okay now once you have made the bill the bill amount is 759 the main thing is the bill remains in a pending state okay which means you can edit it at any point of time and add a number of more items also let's say 5455 five, five. okay so this way you can add multiple pieces into the bill then again you can click on save button okay here discount change to 2.5 percent if you want to make 5 percent again click on 5 and say save so here i still i don't want to print anything now my invoice amount changed so still the status is p so this will go into uh, uh, a next status has to happen is a so agla status jo a hona chahiye uske liye aapko pay now button pe click karna hai pay now pe you will have to choose your payment mode payment mode cash rahega cash in hand cash payment ho raha hai 15 18 rupees agar kuch balance hai to you just have to write here ki kitna balance hai uh, the, the payment which you have received 1000 rupees 518 is the balance if second payment 518 uh, 518 is going to be done by card swipe you should have a bank account added into the system which is not uh, there in place at the moment let us consider that 1000 rupees paid and 518 would be balance so this is one thing now uh, let's say uh, the complete payment is paid okay and you received 1600 from customer say 1600 so it will tell you return value should be 82 rupees this is like tender cash okay now uh, i'll click on pay now so payment voucher would be generated okay payment voucher generated now print invoice i said no okay 
now this status is a for example if i want to see a print bill i can check here okay uh, in sale only this is the print bill 1518 is the total amount okay here you can see what is the amount 1518 print bill this is the format cgst 2.5 2.5 sgst 2.5 2.5 percentage okay see this cgst sgst igst here you can see 2.5 percent 2.5 percent so total discount given 80 rupees okay everything is given in this bill now for example the scenario is uh, you were supposed to give 10 percent discount to the customer but by mistake you have given only 5 percent now you want to change now you have to change the percentage which is not actually possible at this point if you say edit cannot edit payment cleared so how will you do that for that you have to click on change status first of all so by clicking change status actually you are deleting all financial transactions of this page print okay for uh, of this invoice say super password enter enter all financial transactions are dele deleted now status is again became p so here i can edit and i'll say 10 percent so the values are changed now click on save no here the invoice is created now i'll make payment pay now so this is the complete repeat process if you do something okay do you want to print invoice i'll say no okay done so this is the way we will be creating salesman and attaching them with the order uh, sales bill and this way you will be uh, using your uh, billing system along with the salesman thank you for watching this video if you need any assistance please feel free to contact us on our landline on our mobile number and email id thank you very much